What's up YouTube? This is LDS Reliance. I'm back again today to do another solar video. This time we're going to talk about thermophotovoltaics. Thermophotovoltaics have been around since the 1950s. However, there's new research being put into this technology that could radically improve solar panel efficiency. Thermophotovoltaics, or TPV for short, are power generating systems that convert thermal energy into electrical energy. These systems use an emitter and a converter, or a PV cell, to achieve power generation, and sometimes filters, concentrators, and reflectors are used to boost power generation and efficiency. The energy emitted from the emitter can be the entire light spectrum or a specific range of wavelengths, such as infrared, which can be optimized for absorption. The power converter receives the light energy where it regenerates and separates electrons or hole pairs, which converts that energy into electricity. This is the same process used in traditional solar panels. So what does this have to do with traditional solar panels? Well, the efficiency of solar has been hovering around 23% for a while as research and development on photovoltaics has not yielded much improvement. One of the limitations of this is heat. Heat is the enemy of PV, as the higher the temperature of the solar panel, the lower the efficiency and power generated. But what if that heat energy could be converted to electricity as well? I read an article recently that gave me hope that this could be a reality. A team of researchers at UC Berkeley published a paper detailing successful integration of TPV with PV and achieving an efficiency of 29%. While that may seem a modest increase, they saw these results despite only using a simple gold mirror as a reflector. The team plans to add a dielectric layer above the gold mirror in the future, which will increase efficiency to an estimated 36%. Eventually, this same team plans to continue tweaking the design to try to achieve 50% efficiency. Will they be successful? Only time will tell. But the idea of collecting energy from waste heat in a solar panel is one of the most promising ideas I've seen in a while. It doesn't require any exotic materials or a redesign of the traditional solar panel. A breakthrough like this could be adopted rapidly and commercially available within a few years instead of a decade or more like carbon nanotubes or inorganic cells. That's it for this video. If you guys want me to go more in depth on TPV in the future, let me know in the comments.